Our camera lens trained on one man. He's been in terrific form as evidenced by four goals in three games. Stay with us. Hello to you, wherever you happen to be. Our action comes to you today from Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this game. Oh, yes! He's going to be proud of that moment! What purity of strike! Caught it absolutely perfectly! Well, we won't get tired of seeing this, will we? Because that struck so sweetly. He really does surprise everybody here, not least the keeper. What a good finish that is. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Maguire. Here's Luke Shaw. Well, as we look at the table, it's crystal clear why the away fans are so frustrated, Stuart. Well, things just don't seem right at the club, do they? They should really be challenging for the title, but over the course of the season, they've just not performed as a unit. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And he's made headway. And now having a go. Save, but still a chance. Superb chance. He's got it by the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it. And just look at that strike. He opens up his body and makes a really clean contact with the ball. A great finish. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. He's protecting it well. Oh, but they've lost it now. Well, Sergio Ramos has been figuring prominently on the back pages in recent days. If reports are to be believed, this could be his final season. Could have... Goodness gracious me! How about that for technique? You can't strike them much better than that! Well, look at the replay here, because they don't come much better than this. He hits it so sweetly. What a goal this is. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. United could be onto something. Real chance. Was an important piece of defending. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. A goal! Calmly taken spot kick! Well, here it is again, and just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. 
So back underway, 3-1 the score. And he got to it fairly easily. Wasn't a great piece of passing. Oh, he's gone for goal! And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Rashford in the middle. And in the end, no damage done. Here's Luke Shaw. Aston Villa regaining possession. And support available. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. There's certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Here's Luke Shaw. Well, he's beaten his opponent. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. So the current scoreline, 4-2. On to Wan Bissaka. Here's Wan Bissaka. Really good challenge. Atletico Madrid dipping into the transfer market. Not a huge surprise, but exciting news for their fans, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, he's certainly got ability. A lot of clubs have been in for him, but now he needs to fulfil that potential. He might just have to be patient, though. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, they have the ball once more. Long range effort. Pressing high up has its advantages. A goal here, giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, let's take another look, and wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Christian Eriksen now. It was a menacing attack, but tidied up. 
can they hit on the break? Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Oh, he saved it well. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Delivering it. Oh, yes! Dispatching it with a plum! Wonderful goal! Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, there we have it. That's going to be all for the first half here in the Midlands. And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, you won't see too many better performances than this. He's been an absolute menace to these defenders today. And, of course, he's taken his goals really well. So the ball rolling again, and no sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between the sides in the first half. Will we see a response in the second 45 from United? Plenty of support here. Oh, managing to beat him. Could pull one back here. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Oh, I can't believe it. He's gone and missed the chance. Well, what a glorious chance that was. One he should be taking, that's for sure.
Courtois. And tidily played. And a long way out. Oh, and it goes! Sensational strike! And now he deserves to celebrate! Well, just take another look at this. He reads the flight perfectly, catches it so sweetly, and then bang. Not sure if the keeper was caught off guard. It's a long way out, but what a great strike. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? Aston Villa goal, number 43, Jude Bellingham. Don't forget we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Aston Villa facing Fulham. Teammates available. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. <laughs> Trying his luck from long range. And so near on the volley. Well, he'd be frustrated with that finish. That was a big opportunity there. Under pressure. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? Asking a lot of any player, quite honestly, to score from that position. Well, I don't need to say too much about that, do I, Derek? Maguire. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Manchester United versus Luton Town. United being afforded too much space. This might be ideal for the counter. Oh, that is a goal from long range. He won't soon forget. Absolutely right out of the top drawer. Well, we won't get tired of seeing this, will we? Because that struck so sweetly. He really does surprise everybody here, not least the keeper. What a good finish that is. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. It's with Diallo. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Could be. And the keeper more than equal to the task. <laughs> Playing it short. Keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. Yeah. 
Trying to pick out a teammate. Danger averted for now. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? Well, to think he only had the keeper to beat. Couldn't take the opportunity. Maguire. Oh, he's given it away. Really have to get it spot on to finish from there. And it was miles off target. Well, maybe not the right choice there. That's a poor effort. Running room galore for United. Giving them a different option by moving in field. Having a shoot. Oh, he's put it just a fraction wide of the post. He's just going to score instead. I remember this for the Cardinals. You keep talking how you score. That's not that for you. When Kevin De Bruyne and Austin, the men you've got more than that, it's the one of the reasons. I don't know why De Bruyne and Austin were. And David Silva. Honestly. And here, Danny Alley gets hit by a bottle and then what's going to happen there? The Arsenal players with him. And Danny Alley's confused for that. Oh! John McGinn. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes of this one. Showing ambition to shoot from there. Goalkeeper has it. Promising pass. McGinn showing ambition. Corner given. And the cross into the middle. Rashford. Corner coming up. <laughs> Oh, majestic finish! He's going to be rightly proud of that moment. Magnificent! Well, what a piece of skill this is. It had everything. Agility, technique and power. It's a great goal. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. Ten Hag's team just haven't been good enough today. It's been a poor performance. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Well, the referee trying to play advantage there, but it wasn't forthcoming. Well, the ball goes out of play for what will be a goal kick.
winning the match is a place to the same. That's the Christian Eriksen now. Good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? Well, racing fast as man. Oh, he saved it well. well just letting it run over the byline and a corner here. And they've been getting two substitutes warmed up, and both will come on here. Over it comes, and the keeper left us in no doubt that that was always going to be his ball. Now will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? Oh, a smart stop! Here's a change for Manchester United. And he's fired over the corner. Can he put it in? Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Ericsson. Let's fly here. And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. And there goes the whistle for full time. The Villa fans will leave the stadium happy on the back of this victory. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, really, no complaints whatsoever about his performance in this game, Stuart. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today. Uh, uh, the point. 